it's almost exactly what you want to see. McGregor got the nod on the cards. President Huberto Jesus Mendoza, the Super E, Mr. Bob Williams. So into the first round we go, they shed and black. They just hold that lead hand low. When he won that Mexican bantamweight title, he won it looking nice and busy early on. And he's a very proactive kind of fighter too. A lot of from him, Matt. He's, he's right on you. He's not too gung-ho or wrecked. I think this is going to be a good fight. Already just seeing the first minute here, both guys throwing plenty. That left hook, he throws it quite long. He chops that right hand down, head and body. I think we're in for a, a real good fight here. His hands go, Aviles, as I say, up up from the waist and get some power and use that. Yeah, nice work there from Kash Farouk, working the body. Dips low at the waist at times, but as he's moving in, stays loose. If he's not stiffening up, he's not tense. Got through, right hand. He was trying to sneak around the back and then they trade Farouk with a right hand to the body. Again, that's good work. Upper body movement, those reflex. Plenty thrown in that opening round. That's what we expect. An easy thing to do. Wasn't easy. Originally settling in London, then with him coming back. And here we are. He's right hand there. The combination of punches there from Farouk. Just Farouk has started efficiently. He's setting his feet and looking for some purchase on. At the start of this second round, he's. He's not been nearly as expansive as he was in the first, not yet anyway. Yeah, I think from Farouk again, that short right hand, he's thrown that lovely he is. Just body and head, and then he rolls away as he did there, just whips that right. Dreamly effective. Slipping outside, left hooks the body, really good work from Farouk. Villas just pouring with that jab, he's got with the left there, but Farouk gets up close, and again, just bearing the real tough one for Villas. He's been expecting this to happen for the last couple of months, really. With the date being put back two, three weeks, fighting weight for a fairly long period. But he seems to have to throw a bit more at the start of this third round. I think he knows that every shot in the book from Kash Farouk is a shot selection. And I mean, I really like the style of Farouk. He's setting it up behind the jazz and anything. He's just in a beautiful rhythm here, going head to body up and down. His feet back, not far, just a few inches. Kept himself out of range. And that's the body, left hand, right hand of his. Looking to yeah, tip tap into the head, touching with the uppercut, and then switching the body just goes wide shots. Got to watch out for those, but he has got good close. Farouk's got just enough room to work, and Villez hasn't got quite enough work that he's putting in here. Is he's taking it out of there, then touched him the left uppercut, then to the left hook round the side, then he's stepping over to his right. So into round four, Cash Farouk on his matchroom debut in the red. Look at the uh, sat in his corner in between rounds, and he was sucking in the weighted a long time for this and he has to his credit he's soaking these up so far you do wonder he should ratio here or percentage great that he's sitting here and accuracy and for that work rate so he's just trying to pick his time he's waiting for his chance because he knows he can't match farouk i mean that's just beautiful work there obscure in his corner even though we're in the fourth round here you've got to start you've got to be thinking in terms of you give him one more maybe a cut the power of farouk if it's hurting avias he's tough and you know lovely short right hands left hook combo and then we see the beautiful power of range he quite often stays in there and because he's willingly retreating to the ropes retreating to corners now via he's not looked really hurt at any point but He's just the got, and then he, he finds the, gets the right distance. Fairly late replacement, but she seems to have taken most of it in her stride. Well, more of the same at the start of round five, and but isn't showing any sign of dropping. He's then that's always the position you want to. The garden, Farouk. Dig the left hand to the body there of Villez, but every time he opens out, him, and then right at the start of the second round, from that point onward, I don't think many fighters could. I mean, he just hasn't stopped. And I think Villez is just trying to load up a match for Rook. Closing seconds of round five. as I am right now, I mean, he's 
The scene just oh, flow oh. in. I mean, he's put right hand there, jab into the body. It's to nil on your scorecard. It couldn't possibly be. Not towards the upper echelons, but him over here. He's having said that, a full of high level fight. British and Commonwealth titles on the line. Best to him. Great to see him win that title. And then good right hand there from Avidez. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. Plenty of heart. He's looking to try and throw back when he can. But he's been on the receipt. Well, let's have a look. He's got another four rounds of it to sustain here. If yeah, I'm not sure what kind of power Farouk has. All of energy is really is. He looks as comfortable doubling and tripling up with the right hand as he does with the left. In behind the shoulder there of Iez with that low lead hand. Again there, double jab and then a double left hand. Coming from a way out. Nice short right hand of his own there. Really brilliant to watch. We've seen him boxing on the undercard of... Yes, just turning side on almost the other side. It was a crafty bit of work, that a neat bit of work. I mean, this is professional boxing, Matt, and professional. I don't, I don't think Farouk's got the power to knock him out, but he's just getting beaten up. You know, it's just lovely. Yeah, well, sometimes you're feeling the pace and you're in control. Maybe just, I don't know, be shocked if anyone's seen it any differently. But he's uh, a good left hook there from Farouk, and I think of Yes is a little bit stunned by that. Just trying to climb into him here, catch Farouk. But yes, did well because he was definitely stung from Farouk. But I think he's hurt Farouk with that body shot. In as Farouk was moving forward himself, getting onto the front foot. Yeah, I mean, so many clean, hard shots here. Well, as I mentioned, according to the official record, the feet so he only started out at minimum weight, which is hardly. a one-sided fight that I've enjoyed so much. Oh, very good. Shame, but he definitely stunned him. He jumped on him. Threw a lot of hard shots. Yeah, so the man is going to earn every single... What's so impressive about with the little screw shots and uppercuts and then up real... Really, I have to say, I've, I've said it before and I'm saying it again. See in there that, that he does need to work on, he needs to particularly improve. Constantly works you over and, and, and you see him here, he did beat down and he, he, his repertoire is, is going to be tougher tests and maybe we'll see some weaknesses. Sensationally entertaining. It was, as I said, debate controversy. They're two young fighters undefeated. Rouse go against Edin. Tucking up, managing to protect the head and the body on that occasion, and then just there be, as that was a decent shot. And he's got through every now and again. To watch the, how stylish she is. What a skill set. Bell goes, so one to go, three minutes remaining. Roll. He didn't throw the left up that time, he, he rolled back out. To get through here, Avillez, and as Matt has said, he's got a lot of, he's had a man in front of him who has been ripped from the, the sheer volume, punching the work rate, the cut tuck up and, and go into defensive mode a bit. Immediately obliges, just backing up a little bit, looks for the right hand. Do you know what he's in perfect position, he can always come firing back with shots. Looking to throw the left hand. Or fighter do that. Ricky, Ricky Hatton fought with a phenomenal, really to burst into a sprint. If you're, in, if you're a fighter, that's got a nice... So well into the final minutes. In ranking with the WBA, always... Hard to he's only got a few seconds remaining. Really hurt at, at any point, but he's just taken. After Avia's top of now, I've got to say, I am really, really... In front of us. Yeah, beautiful jab again there. Left hook coming. Ooh. So Kashparuk with the...